North Carolina's 9th Congressional District race, rocked by allegations of voter fraud, now in even more turmoil this evening. The Democrat, Dan McCready, says he's withdrawing his concession after growing evidence of fraud, which allegedly benefited the Republican, Mark Harris. I didn't serve overseas in the Marine Corps just to come back home and watch politicians and career criminals attack our democracy. And I call on Mark Harris to tell us exactly what he knew and when he knew it. Harris currently leads McCready by 905 votes. I want to go straight now to the executive director of the North Carolina Republican Party, Dallas Woodhouse. And Dallas, I appreciate your time. Okay, uh, trying to get uh, understand as much of this as we possibly can tonight. First, you just heard Dan McCready. He's taking back his concession. Uh, do you support a new election in this race? Uh, we're not that. We're not quite there yet. Uh, Ms. Burnett, I mean, it is our position that the Board of Elections has to come out and lay out everything they know. And the question of certification of the race, of co course, is separate uh, of the federal uh, and the criminal federal and state investigations, which have to continue. We have to put people in jail who violated the law. But the question of certification needs to be a numerical one. Is the illegal behavior, the bad behavior, enough to call into question the outcome of the race. If that is the case, uh, the, the law requires a new election and we will not oppose it. If the State Board of Election can definitely say that the bad behavior, the criminal behavior that should be prosecuted did not rise to a level of putting the outcome of the race in doubt, then Mr. Harris needs to be certified. I think the more likely outcome is the Board of Elections is not going to have had sufficient time to answer those questions. Right. And since the Democrats and the U.S. House have already said they don't plan to seat Mr. Harris, it seems like to me the investigation has to continue to these questions are answered for the people of the 9th District okay. and North Carolina. But North Carolina State Board Leslie McRae Dallas Jr., a political operative who worked for Republican candidate Mark Harris, as a person of interest in connection with an alleged absentee ballot operation in the Congressional District. The news comes as the Wake County District Attorney's Office and the North Carolina State Bureau of Investigation investigate criminal allegations that Dallas used absentee ballots to alter the vote in Bladen County in the race for North Carolina's 9th Congressional District. Harris leads Democrat Dan McCready by only 905 votes. Wake County District Attorney Lauren Freeman confirmed Friday that the FBI is assisting in the investigation. I will confirm we have had the assistance of the FBI, Freeman said. The FBI would not confirm or deny if it was investigating. Now, investigators are probing whether some absentee ballots were altered by Dallas and a loosely connected group working with him, or if ballots collected from, or if ballots collected from voters were never turned in. Dallas worked for Red Dome Group, a GOP political consulting firm that Harris paid more than $400,000. CNN has made multiple daily attempts to reach Dallas for comment. He has not returned CNN's calls. He has denied wrongdoing to the Charlotte Observer. According to a statement from the board, it has issued subpoenas for documents to Red Dome Group, the Mark Harris for Congress Committee and the James Atlas McVicker Committee. The statement also said that the board plans to schedule an evidentiary hearing as it weighs whether to certify the election results in the race. On Friday, Harris tweeted a video statement where he said he would support a new election if there is evidence of election fraud. I'm hopeful that this process will ultimately result in the certification of my election to Congress before the next House session begins, Harris said in the video. However, if this investigation finds proof of illegal activity on either side to such a level that it could have changed the outcome of the election then I will wholeheartedly support a new election to ensure all voters have confidence in the results. Earlier this week, McCready withdrew his concession in the race amid investigations surrounding the allegations of election fraud. Either I'm Mark Harris. By now you've probably seen news reports about alleged irregularities in the recent election. I wanted to personally let you know that my campaign and I are cooperating fully with the State Board of Elections investigation and we will continue to do so. I trust the process that's underway, just as I've always trusted the decisions of the voters. I trust that this investigation will be full and complete, examining any alleged irregularities that could have benefited either party in this election or past election cycles. The integrity of our electoral process 
is the heart of our democracy, and we must protect it. And although I was absolutely unaware of any wrongdoing, that will not prevent me from cooperating with this investigation. I'm hopeful that this process will ultimately result in the certification of my election to Congress before the next House session begins. However, if this investigation finds proof of illegal activity on either side to such a level that it could have changed the outcome of the election, then I would wholeheartedly support a new election to ensure all voters have confidence in the results. As we move toward resolution, I look forward to participating in a transparent, factual, and fair process. Thank you, and God bless you. Reported Friday Harris is $3,000 after last month's election to Red Dome Group. More than $34,000 of Harris's debt to Red Dome Group centered on a reimbursement payment for blatant absentee work and other election efforts, according to a post-election report Harris's campaign filed late Thursday with the Federal Election Commission. Red Dome had hired Dallas to perform get-out-the-vote work for Harris's campaign. His campaign. Yeah.